Hello and welcome back to the Trainers of the World Tournament. I'm your host, Delta TDS, and today I'm joined by my co-host, Will. I'm back again. And today we've got the Kanto Gym Leader, Misty, going up against the Trial Captain, Sophocles. Yeah, um, I'm going to curse it. This is a one-sided looking match. I mean, last time so I now, said that, uh, Price beat Olivia, so... Exactly, now Misty's gonna win, obviously, so... Yeah, I mean, a fan favorite. We can't have those lose their first match, right? Uh, surely not. Surely not, you know, with what happened within. Anyway, uh, Misty's gimmick is a Mega Gyarados, as Sophocles has a Z-Crystal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. uh, we don't know, again, which Pokemon has that, so we're just gonna have to watch the battle and see. Absolutely. Uh, my guess is, uh, obviously it's gonna be on the Tug of Tomorrow. Oh, that absolute monster over there, yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be like a, uh, fuck, what's the name? Uh, Z Defense Curl, uh, of course. Z Defense Curl mixed with the Protect. Mm -hmm. But, uh. I mean, it's gotta just get, like, more and more round. Yeah. And then it's gonna go for a rollout and just take everything out. Yes. But once these trainers are ready, we can begin. Match number 49, I think that's the number. I'm about to lose count of these. We've done quite a few. Misty leading off with that Lapras against Sophocles' Togedemaru. As that thing is sent out, there is lightning striking outside my room. Um, I hope you do not get struck and die. It would be a message from the gods for Sophocles to win, if that happens. Uh, yeah, it is just, uh, you know, fated to be. If Okay, tell you what. If you get struck by lightning and die, then we will just assume that Sophocles wins, just win by default. Yeah. You know what? If this recording cuts off because my electricity goes out, Sophocles gets the win. Doesn't matter if Misty's up one to oh. Uh, Misty getting that burn and, on the Electivire. Yeah. I was about to say, Electivire got burned and that's bad for it. Yeah. Ice Punch only dealing that's, a third to Dragonite. Well, that, that actually is still kind of a lot because this Dragonite probably has multi-scale and a burn on Electivire, so it doing a third of its health is kind of a lot, all things considered. Yeah. I think an another one should take it out, right? Uh, it should, yeah. I mean, doing the math, if it's, I think, the same exact roll or higher. And it yeah. does go first. Electivire pulling through that burn. Slowbro coming out yeah. here. The boy. Himothy. Himothy? Himothy Chalamet. The quick uh, actor was in Dune. You know. You're familiar. I know the popcorn bucket. You, you don't know who Timothy Chalamet, I mean, Timothy Chalamet is? He was also in uh, the new Wonka movie. I... Looks exactly like Slowbro is what I'm saying. Oh, okay. Yeah, definitely. You know. Look it up, it's true. Yeah, I'll put a comparison of the two side by side. Mm -hmm. uh, anyway, Gyarados coming out. Yeah, that Earthquake taking out the Lantern, feeling the last bit of health to it. Yeah, that was... 
the last uh, the last thing that's going to be able to resist any of these uh, electric type moves that uh, Sophocles is going to be throwing out. Gyarados going for that dragon dance as Golem goes for rock slide, but it does fall to that waterfall. This now. Yeah, I was about to say, uh, Alolan Raichu is a pretty fast Pokemon, but it's not faster than a D-danced Mega Gyarados. This might just be curtains for Sophocles this game. Vikavolt's got it. Quick Claw oh my does god. take out the Gyarados. Oh my god, there's no way. The so Sophocles even called it, just saying Quick Claw time. And it's just activating right on cue. Yes. Uh, more further evidence that this game is... Great. Man. Oh my god. Uh, does this Vickable just take it now off of that? Yeah, it's gonna get it again. Watch. Well, I don't think it even... Well, does it need to? Bad. Oh, I guess it does. Yeah, Vickable is like... Slow. That's so like it looks like it should be a decently fast Pokemon. I mean, it's a railgun, so I suppose it's got it's got to charge up. But once it does, it hurts. Mm. Yeah, Magnazone though coming out, he's got the table. I don't know if Slowbro's gonna be able to deal with it. Yeah, definitely not. Is Sophocles just? Turning that game around with that 10% chance and taking it game number one. I mean, if it was 10% chance. You know, quote unquote, allegedly. Which is, I mean, it's really kind of incredible that he even needed to turn it around in the first place, though. Yeah. Uh, I guess we should let you guys know, uh, each trainer gets a, uh, Gets like a special. Oh, make sure this happens once every match, and that was Sophocles making sure that quick quick ball works. Yeah, no, we uh, nobody's used it before now, but uh, it's it's actually a new rule in round two. But we're in game number two right now. Uh, we saw the Dragon Dance Gyarados, uh, Electivire hitting like a truck. No explosion yet, which I kind of really want to see. Yeah, I, we definitely we, we want to see something just uh, blow itself up. Anyway, once the trainers are ready, we can begin game number two. Misty leading off with that Dragonite as Sophocles leads off with Raichu. Go for a yes. C electric terrain. These all these obscure Z moves here recently, I feel like. Yeah. The C look at that. Fire Punch almost took it out. Uh second one with Yeah. Uh, and out comes the Alolan Golem. I feel like that Z electric train was useless. Now that I'm thinking about it. I don't even know what that shit does, to be honest. It gives it plus one speed on top of Raichu Surge Surfer, which doubles its speed in electric terrain. So it was just ridiculously fast. Nope, oh, there's we the explosion that we were Yeah, about. we got the explosion! Let's go! First the Golem the Classic. We 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 kind of told him, you know, like explosion, no balls, and and he did it. So, kudos. Well, it's exploded. My main goal is to blow up. And act like I don't know. No, you, you should have just left it. Oh. That was that was that was the goal. He just he just came in. He said, "My main goal is to blow up," and he did. Gyarados setting up that Dragon Dance once again. Uh, Indeed. 
All right, let's see the Vicavolt get that quick claw again. Yeah, come on. Here he comes. Oh, Misty actually using her cheat yeah, to make sure it doesn't happen. And, and getting the flinch, too. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. As we said, everybody gets one cheat. I I don't know if there's much sock please can do. Yeah, Togedomaru, the uh, the last hope. Gotta just uh, to start using that rollout. Give everybody just the most horrific Whitney flashbacks. Pull out the nuzzle. Let's go. Come on. Uh, what's your uh, What's your favorite Pika clone, by the way? I gotta go with the world champ, Pachirisu. Obviously. Yeah. That's... <laughs> I don't think what I've a... seen any other make it to world. No, because they're all bad. Oop, it's dead. If it's not making it to world, I don't want it. Misty, right. with Those are that... some pretty high standards. They were met, weren't they? Misty taking game number two. Uh, with that Mold Breaker Gyarados. Just sweeping everything. Including that sturdy Magnezone. Yeah. That uh, Mold Breaker really coming in the clutch there. Uh, we're back on the field for game number three. Like I said, uh, last match, uh, the next two are going to be game number threes. Of course. Because that's how we've scripted it. Spoiler alert. I should point out that, uh, contrary to the first game, uh, Misty won the second one pretty handily. Yeah. I don't think she even sent out, like, four of her. I think she just did it with the Dragonite and the Gyarados, right? That's all she needs, as one of the spectators are saying. This is without any rain dance, too. Ah, oh, this is true. Slowbo did get exploded, so there was that. Let's see the second explosion. Yeah, lead off with the golem. Explode it, run, you know, turn one. If we're gonna cut this out, then I'm. That means I'm free to start saying slurs, right? And we're back. Don't say slurs. What? What do you mean? Uh, once these trainers are ready, we can begin, uh, game number three. Uh, no slurs were said in the little break we had. That You you say that like it, you're trying to cover up the fact that some actually were. Why are you making it sound more suspicious than it is? They'll never know. Okay, I'm just gonna cut it out, and it's gonna be deleted from history. Once I delete Gosh. the... Once I delete this audio file, it's gone. No more. It's gonna show up on the dark web one day, and your career's gonna be ruined. Or, it's gonna shoot up. In well, popularity. Uh, it's sitting in that Magnazone as it takes that s a second surf. Signal Beam oh. almost takes Just that Starmie. Bare, but it is confused, though, so... Roll the dice here, if Starmie actually gets to get this last surf off. It does not. It dies. Dragonite, the answer here to Magnezone. We've seen this thing wreak its own havoc. Fire Very much punch. so. Fire Punch will go ahead and finish off that Magnezone. Right, here's, the, here's what happens right now. Dragonite? Yeah, D dances. Golem goes for... No, that's not what I was imagining, but... Going for a rock polish? I don't... I mean... I don't think an explosion is gonna... Gonna kill from 100% onto this Dragonite with multi-scale. Now it will, though. Oh, it definitely will now. Well, it would be... Super effective. Uh... It would be base 250 power... Electric staff. I mean, true. 
now this golem has three times speed, so it's actually uh This thing is now an ICBM. Yeah, this the next Pokemon this thing, it locks onto, it's dead. Yeah, it just it just dies. Alright. Slowbro taking one for the team yet again. The the homie taking two you know you know two nuclear warheads to the dome. Yeah. Uh goodbye, buddy. A second ICBM has hit slow, bro. This time, it's stronger than the last one. Well, no, they were much faster than the last one. Well, I mean, force does equal mass times velocity or whatever physics. I don't remember from junior year. Uh, it's in the past, it doesn't matter. And softly sending in that toe tomorrow as... Misty sends in that terrifying Gyarados. A nuclear warhead has hit Lego City! Hey! Hey! Zing Zap. Build the Fallout Shelter! <laughs> Zing Zap dealing just under half to that Gyarados. Going for that spiky shield. I'm gonna protect it. I don't know what it's gonna do now. <laughs> Cry. Yeah, it's not Patrice. Yeah, Patrice would have lived that. Actually, I'm curious. Is there a Patrice in the tournament? No, there's one. I think we found the champion. I don't know about that one. I don't know. The Skiridos, I mean... You know, for how much we, Misty we hates it in the anime, Gyarados is putting in a hell of a lot of work. I mean... Hold on. Big of old still sitting there. Is the rail gun gonna charge it? Yeah, who's cheating this time? Waterfall. And Thunderbolt does take out that Gyarados. Uh-oh. Well, I do think both of these Pokemon on Misty's team are faster than it, but neither of them are going to be faster than the Raichu, though. Darkwing Arya does finish off that Vickable. Now it's Raichu's turn to see if he can take on two Pokemon. Yeah, you gotta consider though, Lantern is one of them, so it's just gonna probably be hitting for neutral damage. Yeah. Thunderbolt dealing over half to that Lapras, Sparkling Aria also doing over half, but Lapras healing up back to over half. <laughs> oh, just the... popping the Z move there for Gigglebolt Havoc. Not taking any low rolls. Yeah, one of that shit dead. But is Lantern going to be able to clutch it out here? Going for the skull, getting 30%. Alright, hear me out. If right you crits... Oh, it all comes down to the crit. Oh man. I mean, what? I didn't want Misty out of here. <laughs> That'd be crazy. Well, Misty, it takes game number three, which means that she moves on to round number three. Uh, that was quite the match. Uh, quite indeed. Close. Once again, uh, the supposed underdog win, because I said so. Join us Monday for, uh, Faba, I don't even know his trainer class, uh, going up against Factory Head Thornton. So well, thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you then. Take care. Peace.